With a changed structure, the new season of the UEFA Champions League is starting in September. In this new format of the Champions League, the number of teams has increased, the number of matches for the teams has increased and the prize money has also increased. Draw for the new Champions League under the new structure will also be conducted in a new way. UEFA has arranged the draw in Monaco. Previously, the draw determined which team would play in which group. However, there will be no group stage this time. In the draw, each team will be set to play against eight other teams in a single points table league format. The new structure of the Champions League has been designed by UEFA in response to demands from the influential clubs of European football. The European football governing body has met most of the demands of these wealthy clubs. With the addition of four teams, the Champions League now features 36 teams. Each team will get the opportunity to play at least eight matches. Previously, teams eliminated from the group stage played six matches each. For the first time, Champions League matches will be held in January. The total prize money has increased by 25% to 2.5 billion euros. As the prize money has increased, so has the congested schedule. Previously, there were 96 matches in the group stage, but now it has increased to 144 matches. Playing the reason behind these changes, UEFA has mentioned some key objectives. According to them, the main purpose is to enhance the level of competition throughout the tournament and to increase the number of matches where both teams have something to gain or lose. In the 8th or the final round of the final stage, all 36 teams will play their matches at the same time. This date is set for January 29th. The top 8 teams on the points table will directly advance to the round of 16. Teams ranked 9-24 on the points table. These 16 teams will play in a separate knockout playoff round. The 8 winning teams will then face the 8 teams that qualify directly for the round of 16. The bottom 12 teams on the points table will be eliminated. UEFA's head of competition strategy, Stefano Anselmo, has stated how many points might be needed to progress to the knockout stage in the first round, saying, We have done computer stimulations and found that an average of 7.6 points is needed to advance to the next round, which means two wins and two draws.